So while Aaron's trying to make up some time on the Model A, Dennis and I are going to hit the road and try to make some cash. I don't even know where we're at. We're in Colfax, Wisconsin. Colfax, is... Wisconsin. They actually have bears up here. Bears? I'm serious. In this area, there's bears. So when you're hunting for cars like I do every day, you got to chase down every story you heard. And uh, we heard about a car, 64 and a half K-Code Mustang. Now, they didn't make a lot of these, maybe like 30 or so of them. Now, the reason us car guys call them 64 and a half is that Ford started up the production line to build the Mustangs to be introduced at the 64 World's Fair, the first Mustangs ever. And they were such a huge hit at the World's Fair that they got a ton of orders before even really starting to make them. So the 1964 and a half is technically a 65, but it's one of the very first ever built. The K-Code means that it's the first high-performance model, and that's something I'm really after. So 64 and a half, K-Code, one of the rarest Mustangs ever. How many K-Code convertibles do they supposedly make? 36. Okay, how many do they know where they're at? 11. And here's the kicker. None of those have original paint, and only five of those 11 have the original motor. If this is original paint, original motor, one owner car, it's a Holy Grail Mustang. Oh, my God. He's a Holy Grail. <laughs> this is it. Okay. It okay. really is. Holy I know. Grail Mustang. I know you just hate that. Dude, it is. <laughs> This is going to take some serious coins, so Dennis and I are going to go in halvesies. That's right, a 50-50 split. But he tells me if this car is the real deal, the right buyer might pay in the high six figures for it. That's if. She wants a lot. As a matter of fact, I can't wait to see her face when she tells you what she's asking for. <laughs> Pretty sure you're just going to turn around and leave. Well, if it's a holy grail. It is a holy grail. All right, let's go make some money.